You men in this room, you earned your stripes. That's something that the coaching staff and the personnel staff seen in you that we said, you know what? These guys got an opportunity to put this stripe on their helmet and play for the Cleveland Brown. It's an emotional roller coaster, you know? Like, you have, some things are out of your control, and you have to accept that fact. Once you accept that fact, things are a lot smoother. You know, you just enjoy the ride, man. Just trust your ability, keep your mental stable, and uh, you will go as far as you want to go. See, the thing is, you don't want the call. You don't want the call. You don't get a call, that means you live to fight another day. But if you get the call, that means more than likely you have to come in the office, talk to the coach, and he's going to give you the release paper. So I wasn't looking forward to the call. I couldn't go to sleep because, you know, just the unknown. It's just the unknown. You could be here, you could not. My mom want to come to the game. I, can't, I don't know whether to tell her to come or not because I don't know if I'm going to be here or not. And there's just a lot of stuff going on. So I kind of just isolated myself. I went to the city, you know, just tried to get my mind away, eat some good food, you know, listen to some good music just to kind of get out of sight, out of mind. My biggest thing going into the preseason was just staying consistent. Cause you know, my reps are limited. I just wanted to, with the reps that I had, I wanted to take advantage and just be consistent in every play. Coach told me to get at the R4. I never played the R4, but you know, he told me to get there. So obviously he trusted me to go there. The Browns will punt and it hangs high. Redding underneath it. He catches at the 10, and man, he is smothered by Denzel Rice, who has made two really good plays on special teams kick and punt coverage. I just got there and we got down the field and made the tackle. And I just felt like I belonged there now. You know what I mean? So it's just like that. I just, just felt right. It just felt right. The defensive back group helped me a lot. Those are my boys, man. Uh, we help each other out because everybody's really been through something, you know, that I can relate to. And I've grabbed that from each individual and I've, you know, took it with me and made it, made myself a better player with it. No, I, feel I think I, I gotta be there for you. Once you get the stripe, it's nothing new. The objective is the same every day and that's to get better. So, I mean, the stripe is an accomplishment, but uh, you have to add value to the team. I'm looking to contribute any way I can whether it's at nickel, whether it's at corner, whether it's on special teams. I just want to help the team win. That's my main goal. I'm up to the test.